Hey everyone. Well, I just wanted to show you all right quick. This here, the next, well, this video and probably the next one, I'm guessing. They're going to be a little bit, they're going to be pretty short. But I just wanted to show you all right quick what's happening. As you can see, I got the final drive sitting here. I guess you could call it upside down. But I just got the hub cap here popped off the back. And, well, quick side note, I actually just got a um, an email from Amazon, and sure enough, my camera holder actually came in a day earlier, and so it said it's already been dropped off at my house, and so the good news is I will have that tomorrow morning, and it will make filming a whole lot easier. But anyway, just wanted to show you all right quick. Like I say, I took that hub cap off, and uh, let's see here on the s series gleaner the new the newer s series after they quit the uh, discontinued the r the r series from everything i've been told they went from three bolts in the back of this to four but uh this here is actually the end of uh, well the back the back side of the axle right here going all the way through and the back side that's got three holes for these three bolts this retainer right here holds this back bearing in place this back bearing is what went out on the other side last fall so far it actually looks pretty good getting up kind of close to it right there that way you can see it's got oil into it i can see it it's all wet and so i'm going to take and take these three bolts out and um, uh, the fun job is going to get that is is to get that bearing out of there, and so I have to see about that. Once I can get the bearing out, then this back plate here will come off. I've already taken off these bolts that actually clamp these two sections right here. Oh, I've got a glare from the light. Let me just get the light and show you. There we are right there you can see how they go together you got the back piece here and the front piece down here and so like i say this is going this is just a little short video showing what what it looks like underneath there with that back bearing everything's all still in place and like i say surprisingly everything was pretty good however i'm going to put new bearings in nonetheless so like I say, this is just going to be a little short video update, and the next one may be a short video update as well. So, hey, take care. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.